All right, guys, what a douche your boy X to come at you guys with another video. And in today's video, we're going to talk about my 2022 investment plan. Why? Because you, you, you got to set goals. You have to. You have to know, at least know what you're going towards so you can actually know, get there. And for me, I finally figured out what I want my 2020 goals to be. And I'm going to share with you guys. So... It's gonna be pretty good, it'll be pretty hype. So let's get into today's video. All right guys, so before we get into the video, please consider subscribing to my YouTube channel and most definitely liking this video. A like goes a long way with the algorithm. It really helps push my content to more people. So if you can hit that like button for me, I will most definitely appreciate it and thanks. So we talking investments. Before I tell you my 2022 investments, I want to make sure you understand where I'm coming from. Because in 2021, I got a lot accomplished. Um, I was able to get my second house. Um, I was able to rent out my first house and you know, see what it is to be a landlord. Um, process. I was able to gain traction on my YouTube channel due to being uh, featured on Millennial Money. Um, I was able to help a couple of my friends you know actually get their things together and you know get them a house big excited for that um looking to help two more people i know get them into a house my little brother and the homie rain yes i know you're watching my video oh, I like that. we getting you a house soon we, we talking before march so yeah all right so in 2021 i tried to work as many hours as possible um, I tried a couple things uh, as far as adventuring out, um, trying to do some extra type of investing, you know, those side hustles that can hopefully you know, turn into something. I tried a couple of those. Um, yeah, still working in process. It's a lot harder than it actually seems. I have to give it to the people who do it. You know, my hat's off to you with my scully, you hear me? But um, it's, it's a lot harder. I tried drop shipping, creating a store. Um, truthfully, I made one sale this entire year, and I think I started that drop shipping about, I'll say about three to four months ago. Yeah, and I made like one sale. It's, um, it's a task. I can give you that. So, you no, know, that's one of the adventures I tried in 2021. Whew. But I've tried things, and this was my year to try. So I literally tried, tried, tried as many things as possible. 2022, there are certain things that I tried in 2021 that stuck out to me. And these are things that's gonna get my full on focus in 2022. And that's what I'm gonna discuss with you guys today. Like my actual plan for 2022, what I'm gonna be putting my money in, why? So let's get it. All right guys, so for 2022, these are my go-to investments off the rip. Not even gonna stunt with you guys. Number one is gonna be the thing I wanna make sure I do the most will be my 401k and my job. They do match me. Um, as of right now, I did bump it up in 2021. Um, I'm currently putting $350 per paycheck in. Um, I should be getting a raise again in January. And then, if I'm not mistaken, in March, I should have hit six years at the post office, so I should end up getting another actual raise again. And if, if everything goes right, I'm gonna bump that up to $400 per paycheck. So hopefully I can get that, that way I can get as close to maxing that out at my job as possible. So this will most definitely gonna be my most important off the rip, not even gonna think about it. It's coming, it's just gonna come straight out the check. That's, that's my number one investment for this year. Um, why? Because it's just it's just the most easy and simple thing. Just they match me, they come out my check. Great. Not only that, tax write off. So number one, of course, will be the four hundred one k, four hundred dollars paycheck. Next on the list, as far as um, actual must dos, I'm setting this for myself. I'm saying it, speaking into existence. Um, I'm going to acquire two more properties. How am I going to do this? I'm going to acquire a new primary and I'm also going to acquire another rental. And this is going to be a process for me. This year I was able to secure you know, one extra primary 
and I was able to rent out my old one. This year, I am most definitely seeking to gain two new properties. Um, like I said, one primary, one rental. So by primary, I mean I'm gonna move out of this house, move into a new house, rent this house out, and then I wanna put the 25, 20, 25% down on the rental, and then they'll gain that one. So that'd be three rentals and a primary, which will put me at four houses. And my actual goal when I started, and I said, hey, I wanna get into real estate, was to get five properties. So if I can most definitely know, work this out and get this situated, I'd be so close to my goal. And it's like mind boggling to me. So that is number two on the list. So like I said, in 2021, there were a lot of things I've tried far as options and it really worked out for me um, in 2022 I'm going to focus even harder on this how am I going to do that as of right now I am actually selling some of my stocks out of Robinhood and I'm going to move about $2,900 over into Robinhood and for this account it will be strictly options when I say strictly options literally strictly options uh, I'm not going to invest no more money into the account. Just starting off with the 2900. From there, I'm going to grow the account and do options throughout the entire year to see how much I can come up with. I think it's going to be pretty interesting. Um, like I said, I got pretty good at cover calls. Um, I got good at cash cover puts, and I've done a couple of spreads. And I think I really, I'm not saying no, I'm a professional, no, something like that, but I think I got a good understanding. I've been working on it all 2021 is going to be an experience for me and i think i can turn that 2900 into minimum here i think i could do 25k this year i think i can turn that into that so that's my goal is to turn that to twenty five thousand dollars. so i'm going to be working on that now as far as the options um i do have a discord there's literally nobody in it i'm not I'm like not promoting anything but if you guys are just interested um on some of the plays i'm going to be doing just so you can try to help and learn if you're into that um, my discord is down in the description um also there is a affiliate link for robin hood down there if you're interested in, you know in trying to start investing yourself um a couple of my homies are in the discord and i pretty much just post the option plays i do in there so if you want to join it's not it's down in the link in the description so just join if you want to um but like i said in the discord i will be posting my option plays what i'm looking at why i'm looking at what type of play i did how much i made as far as premium so if that's something you're interested in hey join it glad to have you and like i said the for a link for Robin Hood is down there. If you sign up, we both get a free stock and it can help you know you jumpstart your account. So sign up. It's all I have all type of links down there for all the platforms I use. It's Robin Hood, Weeble, uh, Public. So whichever one you tickle your fancy, whichever one you like, which more user friendly for you, just sign up and then you should get something for just signing up with it's a free stock like five or ten dollars. So so my question to you is what are you investing in? What are your goals? Where are you putting your money this year? Are you doing individual stocks? Are you trying to also get into real estate? Are you at the process? Are you working on your credit? Are you paying off debt? Would love to hear about it. Leave a comment below, or you can just join the Discord down there, like I'll be in there, or you can just follow me on Instagram and send me a direct message. Have you want to do it? Let me let me hear from you guys. But that's all I have to say about this. I'm very excited for your 2022. Big things are coming. Very excited. But um, it's your boy XC. 